with our flashing lights as they fall in Liberty Township Volunteer Fire Department. An interesting note, in May of this year, the department celebrates 100 years of service for Liberty Township. The department has 15 members and responds to over 100 calls a year. They provide fire, rescue, and emergency medical services. Special thanks because they are primarily volunteers and they take of their time to take care of us in time of need. We also have the Wayne Township Volunteer Fire Department and Rochester's uh, department is also represented. Behind them, we have the Fulton County 4-H Horse and Pony Color Guard. The left guard is Aubrey Day, the Indiana flag, Brooklyn Hyden, the U.S. flag, Angela Bennett, the 4-H flag, Adriana Day, the right guard, Sydney Scobie, the point rider is Josie Wilhelm. Boy, don't they look nice. done. Very nice. And it looks like on one of our horses we got a future cowgirl there all dressed out in pink. Hat and boots and everything. Boy doesn't she look sharp up there. And getting ready for a future harness racing is a pony with a senior driver followed by a young driver getting ready. Yeah, watch the uh, debris there. Next coming up is the Fulton County Abate. The Abate of Fulton County is this area's local chapter of Abate of Indiana. Abate stands for American Bikers Aimed Towards Education. Abate provides motorcycle education, fights for legislation, and runs the motorcycle safety course. Abate raises money every year for many charities such as MDA, a burn camp, United Ministries, Matthews Market, and Treasures for Kids. Today they provide for everyone the Tiny Tots riding experience, motorcycle bikes show, and Abate booth. Please stop by their booth and say, ah, uh, welcome to fall, Nebate. South, dressed in uh, pink and black with white pom-pom, is the Caston High School Band and Cheerleaders. They're accompanied by the cheerleaders, are accompanied by the Caston Comet Band under the direction of James Byrne. Caston High School Cheerleaders perform to Dynamite under the direction of Ellen King. And it's also interesting to note this cheerleader group under Ellen King's leadership has done well in national competition and has gone to Florida several times.
those cheerleaders a hand and give that band a hand. Thank you, ladies and gentlemen. Very nice. You can see more of them if you will come to the Caston uh, football games just south of town. The kickoff of the 2012-13 uh, uh, season is this week, or this coming Friday, as a matter of fact. Next, we have the House of Beauty. It's a full-service salon in Logansport on 915 North 3rd Street. Their phone number, 574 753-6038 and they're open Monday through Saturday 9 to 5. Come in and get your hair done. Walkers are Jean Ann Mills, Stylus and Ronetta Alcorn. Next we have Lauren Baird who is Baird who is also coming from behind and ladies and gentlemen this is special recognition because she's 106 years old and just to show you she has seen more change in the last 30 years of her life than she has in the previous 76. So she's had quite a life. Congratulations. Next we have McGrew's Welling Dream. Their rig here is kind of the uh, state of the art rig. They are a full business. And they have been serving this community guests since when? 1907, 105 years. That's outstanding for a small community. The McGrew family wishes to thank all their customers. Thank you very much for all you have done for us. Next on the four wheelers as a group of ladies. So guys, you have nothing on four wheelers. Ladies can drive them too. It's Linda's Outlaws. They began in memory of the friends and family who they've lost to cancer and has expanded into much more. Their namesake, Linda Slater Teal, was diagnosed with breast cancer in 2004, the same year the unit was formed and has since expanded to include many people who have known Linda and other cancer survivors, fighters, and our angels who lost their fight. They lost Linda in 2009. They walk and ride today in honor of those same survivors, fighters, and angels in support of awareness for all forms of cancer. Thank you very much, ladies. group of uh, sickle riders, a couple of pick -em up trucks, and a float. What a nice group, all for the cause of promoting cancer awareness. Cadillac as a character that should be familiar to most people and that's Mr. Ronald McDonald and he's in Ned Rensler's 1967 Caddy convertible driven by Lonnie Stevens. For your info Ronnie McDonald is a clown character used as a primary mascot in the McDonald's fast food restaurant chain. Since August of 2003 McDonald has been officially styled as a Chief Happiness Officer of the McDonald's Corporation as he heads up the corporation's random acts of kindness. They provide Marana McDonald houses where parents can stay overnight when visiting sick children in nearby chronic care facilities throughout the country. Welcome to our parade, Ronald. And in behind him is the Fulton County Ron Bonner Festival Queen, Alicia Clevenger for 2012. Give them all a round of applause. 
And number 15, the Caston Junior High drill team. And it looks like we're on a float today. Is that right up there? Are they strong? It was started in November and performs at junior high boys basketball games. This year they'll be seen a few more places as the program grows. Today the girls are going country with their interpretation of Carrie Underwood's Cowboy Casanova. Michaela Slisher is their director. Good job, ladies. Very good. We're looking forward to seeing you. Behind them comes Dead's Tumble Dance and Cheer, home of Extreme Lightning Competitive Cheer Squad. This group teaches dance to children of ages two and up and also teach cheer. They are always accepting new students for dance, tumbling, and cheer. ladies very very nice being towed on a wagon behind a Massey Harris model 44 we have the faulting bass sunsurf beach bash director of the vocational Bible school who is Diane Raber pastor Bruce Russell sometimes if you can't get to the beach you have to bring it to yourself Vacation Bible schoolers enjoy a week of pretending to be at the beach where they learn who is Jesus, why can I trust Jesus, why do I need Jesus, how can Jesus help me when I mess up, and what does Jesus want me to do. By the way, they have 90 to 100 kids every night in that program. That's excellent.
recipient. In 2011, over 750,000 eyeglasses were distributed. Next, we have Fall County Republican Party with their state representative, Bill uh, Head, in the fire truck, and then he's running for the state senate. And Bill Friend is running for the state representative season. Fulton County Republican float and all of the various candidates that uh, will be on the ballot this fall and from that party. Give them a hand. The next group up is the Rochester Tumbling Express. These young ladies and gentlemen participate in a group that offers tumbling and cheerleading classes at 122 East 7th Street, Rochester. some supervision in that pickup there, making sure you stay right on schedule. That's good. Yes, sir, there's a little history on there. The old push style mower, the first of the real mowers. Looks like that thing came out in 1944. Next behind them, we have the Fall Feed Bag Family Restaurant located right here on Main Street in Fulton. They're open from 7 to 2 with extended hours on Friday until 8. Next we have the Fulton County RMC. Like this bike, powered by members, Fulton County RMC, your Touchstone Energy Cooperative. A bicycle built for two. Oh, and a dog! I didn't see him. He's, he's the supervisor, backseat driver. That's it. Next we have Operation Christmas Child. They are a Fulton County coordinators for Operation Christmas Child, and they are walking to encourage everyone to pack a shoebox in November, bring it to your church or Grace Methodist Church in Rochester. Next we have Better Together, entry number 31 with Dave Summers, Castanera United Methodist Churches working together to show God's love. They are representing Hands of Christ, Kiwana, Grass Creek, Fletcher's Lake, 
Bethlehem 12 Mile and Fulton Churches. They are also sponsoring a free school supplies for children in need. And next, uh, from our neighbor to the southwest in the big city of Royal Center, we have Max Metzger. And he's here today with his 2003 Chevy Corvette. This is a 50th anniversary Corvette that is coming by. And behind that is another Max Metzger entry in a 1996 Chevy Corvette Collector's Edition. There were only 900 manufactured with, quote, spare tire delete, quote, on the window sticker. This car has been awarded the Bloomington Gold Award, and Max is the proud third owner of this car. We have the other half of our bipartisan uh, political uh, structure in the country. This is the Fulton County Democrat Central Committee. It's composed of Rich Ludington, the state representative, Phyllis Bittinger for County Council, Dixie Good for County Council, Darren Beaker, Corner for Democrats Working for You. Give our Democrat friends and their candidates a round of applause. And they, like the Republicans, are also looking for your support at the ballot box this November. We will also have Kerry Worley Worthington, State Representative, District 23. He's running for the state representative in that district. Fred Nancy family and friends tailgate five hours before every home coach football game. We have a 51 international pickup there going on.
2009. It's a Terror Gator 6203, driven by Dennis uh, Dino Rigney, and is used to apply fertilizer on the fields. Normal. But today it is being used to spread fun. He is being helped today by Cameron Klein, holding through uh, Andrea and Adrian and Kaden, uh, Rigney, and Raven and Tyler. Hope we got those names right. Number 45 is a Farmall. Number 49 is a Farmall H. Trackers. Sarah Barrett and the Cowgirls. And the Cowgirls are Mary Severs and her granddaughter Natalia Osborne riding her horse Buddy, who's an American Bay Mustang, 23 years old. And then we have Sarah Barrett on her horse Gordy, a quarter horse paint, 13 years old. Very nice. And behind them, entry number 41, Danielle Beal, and she's riding Dixie Chick, and Kevin is riding Tuga. And behind them, the parade officials in the tail end, Linda Klaus, Connie Hartman, John Moore, Don Klaus, and Larry Watson, represented by Don Klaus on a gator courtesy of Green Power of Florida.